And ahead of the big summit, South Korea's Foreign Minister Kang kyung hwa has visited a U.S. Army division here in South Korea uh, to reaffirm the two countries' strong alliance. She said the alliance stands at a critical juncture to address North Korea's nuclear threats. But Seoul's top diplomat stressed she's confident South Korea and the U.S. can overcome it if they work together. Connie Kim has the details. Commemorating the 67th anniversary of the outbreak of the Korean War, South Korea's new foreign minister, Kang kyung hwa visited the U.S. 2nd Infantry Division in Seoul, highlighting the ironclad, rock-solid alliance with Washington. It marks the first time a South Korean foreign minister has visited a U.S. Army unit for the occasion and thanked the U.S. forces for their efforts in the war. But Kang pointed to the North's rapidly growing nuclear program, which threatens both countries, and said that threat must be confronted for the Allies to move forward in seeking prosperity. Thus, the ROK-U.S. alliance stands at a critical juncture to address this existential threat from North Korea. But I am confident that we can, together, overcome it. With our ironclad, rock-solid alliance and combined defense posture, we can achieve our common goal. The main purpose of Kang's visit was reportedly to highlight the two countries' strong alliance ahead of the first face-to-face -face meeting of Presidents Moon Jae-in and Donald Trump in Washington, which will set the tone of the two countries' relations for the years to come. Our two leaders will discuss joint strategy on furthering our comprehensive strategic alliance. They will also be drawing big pictures on how best to address the North Korean nuclear and missile threat. North Korea has test-fired five ballistic missiles since President Moon took office, adding to concerns that Pyongyang is on a fast track to developing an ICBM that can target the U.S. mainland. But despite Pyongyang's growing nuclear ambitions, Minister Kang's visit to the division reaffirmed the two allies' commitment to, quote, go together, just like the motto of U.S. forces in South Korea. Connie Kim, Adidas News.